are paintings in here. This is sort of fun. These are paintings of mine done around 1982. Each painting is a, uh, is in my opinion, they're all koans, like a Japanese uh, a poem of enlightenment. Uh, this was a this was a painting that I did for my son, who was two years old this year. Wow! And so this was called um, Spring Growth. I tried to imagine myself as two years old and my son and all I knew him for the two years of his birth, and uh, that is what happened. And so that becomes his uh, painting about about him. Uh, this was a painting done for my other son's 13th birthday, and this one I call Rites of Puberty. And I tried to figure out what it, what it was to be 13, and then just acted it out. This painting over here was my sixth, uh, my son, my other son's 16th birthday. So this one's called Sweet 16. How many sons do you have? Three. This was a. Uh, a painting done from our friend Richard Mock, who we've talked about earlier. Uh, he had a, a, a serious problem with diabetes and uh, went into a coma. And uh, fortunately, he came back out and uh, continued to live for another 20 years. But this one is called Wheel of Fortune, and it was done for our friend Richard Mock. This painting here was done, my father died the year before, uh, in 1981, and this was a painting done for him and for myself in the sense that it was a ukulele. He used to play the ukulele. The ukulele was like his right arm. And when I was about 17, we had a party at our house. A lot of kids came from other schools. I didn't know who they were. Someone took the ukulele. So it took me another 30 years to to find it, and this is, the, this is, I purge myself of the feelings of guilt for having lost that. And this is a painting done in honor of my, uh, of the mother of my three boys. Um, and this one was called uh, uh, Flowers for Tia. And so that's what this paint, that's what this room is. It's just a slice of life in my life during 1982.